Sanda is a click language spoken by about 60,000 Sanda people in the Dodoma region of Tanzania. Language use is vigorous among both adults and children, with people in some areas monolingual. Sanda had generally been classified as a member of the defunct Khoisan family since Albert Drexel in the 1920s, due to the presence of cliques in the language. Recent investigations however Goldman 2010, suggest that Sanda may be related to the Ko family regardless of the validity of Khoisan as a whole. A discussion of Sandawi's linguistic classification can be found in Sands, 1998. Sanda has two dialects, northwest and southeast. Differences include speaking speed, vowel dropping, some word taboo, and minor lexical and grammatical differences. Some Alagua have shifted to Sanda, and are considered a Sanda clan. SIL International began work on Sanda in 1996 and to date 2004, Daniel and Elizabeth Hunziker and Helen Eaton continue to work on the analysis of the language. They have so far produced a phonological description, a dialect survey report and several papers on aspects of grammar. Sanda is also currently, since 2002, studied by Sander Steeman of Leiden University. Phonology Vowels Sanda has five vowel qualities. All five vowel qualities may be found as short oral, a, long oral, a, and long nasal, a tilde, vowels. There are therefore 15 basic vowel phonemes. Short nasal vowels also occur, apparently from the historical elision of a nasal consonant that is still attested in related forms. Long vowels are written double, a, ah, and long nasal vowels with a tilde, a. Long vowels are about 50% longer than short vowels. In morpheme final position, low tone, u, and i, are frequently devoiced, though this may not occur after, j, with, or, h. Consonants Non-click consonants The glyphs in italics are the practical orthography developed by Hunziker and Hunziker, followed by approximate equivalents in the IPA. TC and DZ are th and D in the northwestern dialect, but often TS and DZ, or even Z in the southeast. TS for TCH occurs but is less common. Consonants in parentheses are rare. Clicks The clicks in Sanda are not particularly loud, when compared to better known click languages in southern Africa. The lateral click K can be confused with the alveolar lateral ejective affricate T even by native speakers. With the postalveolar clicks, the tongue often slaps the bottom of the mouth, and this slap may be louder than the actual release of the click. Wright et al. transcribed this slap click with the extended IPA symbol. The voiced clicks are uncommon, being found in a few words such as kokomi, greater kudu, and cinco sp bird. Labialized clicks are found in word initial position. The glottalized click phonation is something like creaky voice, not an adjective. In initial position, the glottis is closed during the entire occlusion of the click, and not opened until after the release burst. In medial position, the glottis is closed after the velar closure, and before the forward closure, but opened before the click release. Such clicks are not nasalized all the way through, in some tokens they are simply prenasalized glottalized clicks, k, bearing in mind that the superscript implies coarticulation, that is, that it is pronounced together with a k, not after. The practical orthography is based on Kosa and Zulu. Tone Hunziker et al. 2008 transcribed seven surface tones, high a, uh, mid a, uh, low a, uh, high falling a, uh, mid falling, low falling a, uh, and rising, on long vowels only. High and low tones are fundamental. High falling tones are required in the underlying representation, for example in TSA circumflex, water, but are also often due to a sequence of tones. As in TWI, mid tone does not occur initially. Hunziker et al. analyze it as a downstepped high tone, HLH, is realized as HHM. This rightward shift on the tones is a general process in Sanda. This analysis requires the assumption of floating low tones carried by consonant clusters, and thought to reflect a historical vowel which has been deleted. 
The low and mid falling tones are a prosodic effect, found on final syllables, or on penultimate syllables followed by a voiceless vowel. This leftward shift of tone before voiceless vowels, which by their nature cannot carry tone, is another general process of sanda. Rising tone is only found on long vowels and can be seen as a low high sequence. Thus, at a phonemic level, high, low, falling, and downstep are required. Tone is not written, except indirectly in genitive phrases, which are hyphenated. Phonotactics The majority of Sanda syllables are CV. Morpheme Initially, consonant clusters are of the form CW, these are not found in the middle of morphemes. Most consonants are attested in this CW sequence apart from the labials, the glottals, H, sonorants, R, L, Y, W, and the rather infrequent consonants N, D, DL, and the voiced clicks, which may simply be gaps in attestation. The rounded vowels O, U are not found after CW sequences. Vowel initial syllables, as in seyu, buffalo, are not found initially, though initial glottal stop is not written, io, i acute o acute, mother. Glottal stops, are found as syllable codas, though these may be released in an echo vowel in some circumstances. Hunziker et al. prefer to analyze these are final consonants, because the quality of the echo vowel is predictable, and otherwise this is the only place where the vowels, eao, would have voiceless allophones. Hunziker et al. find complementary distribution between homorganic NC clusters, which occur only medially, there are no word final nasal consonants, and nasal vowels, which they only transcribe word finally. It would therefore seem that NC clusters are the realization of a preceding nasal vowel. Other final consonants are found as consonant clusters in the middle of a word. Historically, these are presumably due to vowel elision, as evidenced by records from the early 20th century and also by tone patterns. In the northwestern dialect, words are found with final consonants where tonal patterns suggest there was once a voiceless final vowel, and where the southeastern dialect retains a voiceless i or u. Grammar pronouns free, pronouns pronominal suffixes syllable structure sanda syllables are usually of the form cv. In monosyllabic words, word final nasals are not uncommon, cv, n. Sometimes other consonants are found in word final position, but this is most probably the result of deletion of word final voiceless vowels. A syllabic nasal m is found in Swahili loanwords. The most common word structure is disyllabic with or without long vowels, cv, cv, according to Devoot, 1992. Nouns Although nouns can be masculine or feminine, there is usually no particular marker that indicates the gender. Many singular feminine human nouns are marked by the ending su, whereas some singular masculine human nouns end in a. Additionally, definite human feminine nouns must be marked with the suffix su, often repeating marking. Gender assignment for most non human animates as well as inanimates is largely unpredictable. However, according to Steeman, 2011, all body parts are masculine, bigger plants are masculine while smaller plants are feminine. Machinery nouns new to the sanda, whose names are typically borrowed from Swahili, are usually feminine, and deverbal nouns representing acts nominalizations, are masculine. According to Eaton, 2010, a masculine noun can be made a diminutive by treating it as a feminine noun. According to Eaton, 2010, definite plural nouns are marked with the suffix ka, while definite associative plurals are marked with the suffix ki. According to Steeman, 2011, definite human plurals are marked with sa. Adjectives the same roots may be used as adjectives or verbs according to Kagaya, 1993, Ix. Syntax Basic word order in Sanda is SOV according to Devoot, 1992. However, word order in the Sanda sentence is very flexible due to the presence of several subject identification strategies. Sample sentence, mid-tones are not marked. An article in Studies in African Linguistics, Volume 10, No. 3, 1979, by Gerard Dalgish, describes these subject identification strategies in detail. Numerous permutations of sentence constituents are allowed in certain tenses, the pattern being, that the first constituent is the subject or b, any non-subject that is first in the sentence must be marked for the subject. Non-subject constituents include verbs, a progressive marker, objects, indirect objects, adverbs, prepositional phrases, complementizers. Similar results are obtained in WH questions. Tone 
Elderkin, 1989, analyzes Sandaw as having two level tones, high, low, and two contour tones, falling, rising. His thesis considers the behavior of tone at word, sentence and discourse level. Devuth, 1992, and Kagaya, 1993, list three level tones, high, mid, low, and two contour tones, falling, rising. Classification the most promising candidate as a relative of Sanda are the co-languages of Botswana and Namibia. Most of the putative cognates Greenberg 1976 gives as evidence for Sanda being a Khoisan language in fact high Sanda to co. Gweldman and Elderkin have strengthened that connection, with several dozen likely cognates, while casting doubts on other Khoisan connections. Although there are not enough similarities to reconstruct a proto co sanda language, there are enough to suggest that the connection is real. However, other linguists have criticized the proposal as cherry-picking among a large number of non-matching pronominal forms. The pronominal system is quite similar. These may cast some light on the development of cliques. For example, the Sanda word for horn, Talana, may be a cognate with the root na found throughout the Ko family. This and other words suggests that clicks may form from consonant clusters when the first vowel of a word is lost, asterisk talana greater than asterisk tlna greater than na, na. Since the Ko family appears to have migrated to southern Africa from the northeast, it may be that Sanda is closer to their common homeland than the modern Ko languages are. See also click language hads a language Khoisan languages notes references bibliography Dalgish, Gerard 1979 subject identification strategies and free word order the case of Sanda in studies in African linguistics volume 10 number 3 pp 273 to 310 Debashi, Yoshihito 2001 agreement and word order in Sanda in Cornell working papers in linguistics 18 pp 57 to 74 Eden, Helen C. 2002, A Grammar of Focus in Sanda, Unpublished PhD Thesis, University of Reading. Eden, Helen 2006, Sanda, Journal of the International Phonetic Association, 36, 235-242, doi, 10.1017, s 2647 Eden, Helen C. 2010, A Sanda Grammar, SIL International. Elderkin, Edward D. 1989, the Significance and Origin of the Use of Pitch in Sandaw, Unpublished D. Phil Thesis, University of York. Goldman, Tom and Edward D. Elderkin, 2010, on External Genealogical Relationships of the Co-Family. In, Brenzinger, Matthias and Krista Koenig, eds. Khoisan Languages and Linguistics, The Rieslern Symposium, 2003. Quellen zur Khoisan Forschung 17. Koln, Rudiger Kopp. Hunziker, Daniel, Elizabeth Hunziker, and Helen Eden, 2008, A Description of the Phonology of the Sandal Language. SIL Electronic Working Papers, 1 Kagaya, Ryohei, 1993, A Classified Vocabulary of the Sandal Language, Asian and African Lexicon Vol. 26. Tokyo, Institute for the Study of Languages and Cultures of Asia and Africa, ILCAA. Sands, Bonnie E. 1998, Eastern and Southern African Khoisan, Evaluating Claims of Distant Linguistic Relationships. Quellen zur Khoisan Forschung 14. Koln, Kopp. Steeman, Sander, 2011, A Grammar of Sanda, A Khoisan Language from Tanzania 2, Utrecht, Landelika Anderzokschool Talwedenschap. Boot, A. Jade, 1992, Some Phonetic Aspects of Hatsa and Sanda Clicks, Unpublished MA Thesis in African Linguistics, Leiden University. Wright, Richard, Ian Maddison, Peter Ladifoged, Bonnie Sands, 1995. A Phonetic Study of Sanda Clicks, UCLA Working Papers in Phonetics, No. 91, Fieldwork Studies in Targeted Languages 3. External links A Sanda Grammar Sanda Word Lists and Accompanying Sound Files at UCLA Helen Eaton More Information on SIL International's Work on Sanda, with Papers for Downloading. Sanda Basic Lexicon at the Global Lexicostatistical Database